All around the world, companies are taking the lead in addressing issues that affect all of us. Issues that range from human rights to corruption and from the environment to labour standards. Corporations are developing market-based business-driven solutions to global challenges. Hi, I'm Hayden Turner and this is Responsible Business. Turning a business into a better corporate citizen doesn't always go swimmingly, but fortunately there are a number of enterprises that specialise in corporate responsibility. One such organisation is BSR, or Business for Social Responsibility. A non-profit organization based in San Francisco, BSR has over the years been able to bring together large multinationals that compete with each other in the marketplace to take on a number of issues with remarkable results, helping these companies develop sustainable business strategies. One example is the Electronic Industry Citizenship Coalition. This group of electronic giants worked with BSR to develop a supply chain code of conduct that addresses specific issues such as labour conditions and business ethics. The group has completed more than 50 shared audits of suppliers and as a result, communications giant Cisco estimates that the audits have saved the company 40% in supply chain auditing costs, allowing its employers and suppliers to focus on product development. It's an expectation that large global brands like Cisco and others that we work with would give money away. Um, many are considering philanthropic investments and community investments to be part of what they do, but it's not the core of their CSR. The core of their CSR is exactly that, how you make money in the first place. What are you doing with your business operations? What are the impacts you're having with your products and services? How do you treat your employees and how do you operate as a, as a corporate entity? Corporate citizenship is at the core of business. BSR initiated the Her Women's Health Project. Set up in 2007, the initiative between international companies, factories and local NGOs aims to improve women's health throughout the supply chain. Both companies and female workers are benefiting from the project. For every US dollar invested in women's health, one Bangladeshi factory has seen a $3 return through higher productivity, lower staff turnover and reduced absenteeism. By the end of 2008, BSR anticipates the project will be active in 25 factories, impacting the health of 50,000 female workers. BSR also takes on the big global challenges, such as climate change. A recent report by the UN showed that emissions from shipping amounted to about 1.12 billion tonnes of CO2 a year, nearly 5% of global CO2 emissions, three times more than it was previously thought to be. We've led an initiative called Clean Cargo, and this project brings together the world's largest sea carriers uh, with uh, very large companies like Ford Motor Company and Nike and IKEA. And together, uh, they've developed uh, standards that have resulted in the reduction of uh, environmental impacts getting products from point of manufacture to point of sale. Now this was an unregulated area of the global economy and we found uh, that by bringing people together we can get real results uh, based on collaboration and innovation. BSR's Clean Cargo Working Group comprises 28 companies representing 65% of all containers shipped globally. Aware that the sector currently lacks the ability to measure greenhouse gas emissions and other environmental impacts, BSR is currently developing performance measurement tools with the Clean Cargo Group and hopes to report emissions figures in the next few months. BSR's proven successes at advancing corporate responsibility among the world's leading businesses has helped grow its member list to more than 250 companies since its inception 16 years ago. As business increases awareness of and takes greater responsibility for the communities in which it operates, 
the potential for sustainable growth in the future can only be greater.